Hey there gamer guys and gals, I'm Richie and welcome to IG Critic and in this video we're going to be playing the demo opening hour of the new video game, Prey. Ah, Mr. or Miss You. Male or female, male or female, um... I'll stick with what I know. Now entering your apartment. You wake up in your apartment in the year 2032. Good year. Or so I'm hoping. Mate, that is one space AG helmet. Look at those prisms. Mate, that's got to distort your vision somewhat. 2032. So that's over, what, 14 years time? No, 16, maybe 18. It's coming up to 2032. Good morning, Morgan. Good Today morning to you, Monday, too. Today March 15th, 2032. Thank you, alarm clock. Ooh, techno music. Oh, we're literally waking up. Oh, wow. Apartment with a view. Morgan's got to be very important. Hey, Morgan. Wake up. You're burning daylight. Alex, Send Alex, you. Oh, we must be related. It's just a few tests. Oh, there it is. Don't forget to wear your suit. See you soon. Well, I, I wasn't going to turn oh, up naked. Listen, well, well, maybe that's normal. Really great you decided to come on board. We're going to shake things up, Morgan. Like old times. Ooh, look at that jump. First day of the job. New objective. You've been given a new objective. Okay, this is my transcribe. The latest touch screen. Our oh, objectives. Alex convinced me I'm going to join him aboard the Talos 1 space station. The work we're doing up there is too good to pass up. Plus, he says he's got a surprise. I have to jump through some hoops at the training center before I board the shuttle. Ooh, nice decor. Mate, Morgan's got good taste. Plastic tubing. Yeah, I'll take that. And a burnt circuit board, I'll take that. And frayed wire, yep, I'll take that too. What else can I take? What's this thing, can I take it? No, I can climb on it, but I can't take it. Uh, use object, oh, I want examine, aha. Ooh, three emails. Unpopular. Uh, congrats and welcome. Hello, Morgan. So glad to hear we'll be welcoming you aboard soon. Your first official workday is Monday, March 15th. But first, we have a series of training exercises we with all new employees. Just some stuff to clear you for life in orbit. Exciting times ahead. Have a good flight, and I will see you soon. From Thomas Tucker, Human Resources. Delivery. Hey, I sent a package with everything you'll need for your first day. Uniform, transcribe, and a neuromod. Install the neuromod right away as we'll be running some tests first thing in the morning. Just follow the instructions. I'll be in touch, Alex. Ah, Big bro looking out for me. Hey, I just got off the phone with mum and dad. They won't be there when the shuttle departs. They're in New York, company stuff, but they send their best. I think mum's a little disturbed that both her children are going to be outside her gravitational pull at the same time. She said you'd better behave and do everything your big brother says. Okay, actually, she said the opposite. I'm supposed to behave and do what you tell me. So there you go. That's mum. Anyway, everyone's excited about your ideas up there, so get ready. I'll probably call you in the morning to make sure you're up. See you very, very soon, Morgan. Love, Alex. Oh, big bro. Preparing me, giving me a new job. Aha, trans star uniform. Let's get dressed. Ooh, leathery. Ooh. Hey, I'm in the hallway. It's too soon. Magazine note. Congrats, Morgan. 
Hey, kings away a sparkling wine. Let's take a drink. Why not? We've got something to celebrate. Statuses. Okay, everything's a bit blurry. And I can't walk in a straight line. Oh, okay, well, that was short-lived. Obviously, people don't get as drunk as much in the future. See, there I am, just wasting water. What does that do? Absolutely nothing. Ooh, yes, take everything. Cold Mountain Green Tea. It's good to have a cup of tea, a nice cup of tea before your first day at work. Ironically, the only thing I cannot read in this apartment is the letters. Emails, magazines, but actual written letters? No. Mate, technology needs to take a step back. Ooh, that's a funky light switch. A funky shower. Ah, there's the water. And now I'm all wet. Thanks for that. Maybe I should have had the shower before I put on my uniform. Mate, that's a lousy reflection. Ooh, nice tie collection. But why are they in the bathroom? Oop, nothing behind the door. Ooh, what's that? It's like a funky controller for that generation consoles. <gasps> oh, now we know what's in store for the future. Neuromod application instructions. Warning, Neuromod should only be administered by certified Transtar technicians under controlled conditions. Subject may experience slight discomfort, swelling or redness of the eye shortly afterwards. 1. Remove Neuromod from vacuum sealed container. Press rubberized eye cup firmly against bony orbit of eye socket. Keep eye open. Depress orange release trigger and continue to hold Neuromod against eye for 5 minutes. Dispose of used Neuromod in provided biohazard bag. Got to keep it against your eye for five minutes, mate. Well, there's no more alcohol in the apartment. Let's check outside. Ooh, there's fish in the skyscraper. Lovely. Ah, Morning, hello, fellow. You. Hello, fellow humanoid. Patricia Varma, talk to heard me. There's a chopper on the roof. Must be for you. You heard correctly. Echelon Residential Tower. Woo! Nice slide sprinting. Uh, my floor roof. Well, let's go to the roof, shall we? Floor 45. Mate, hey, Miss Morgan Yu has done very well for himself. Roof access. Aha! Oh wow, a whole chopper just for me on the roof of my apartment. Look at that, she's a beauty! Oh wow. This is a very nice city. Do I really want to go to space? Open up! Oh, this is not a limo. This is not a helicopter, it's a flying limousine! This is posh. Please make comfortable and we'll be on our way. Transtar facility is just a short hop. Hey. Degrees. Oh, wow. Bethesda way. have also done very well for themselves. Look at their building. Oh, mate. This is uber sweet. Oh, mate. This is first class treatment right here. This Morgan Yu is an important dude. Oh, I'm happy to say, Earth's looking in good shape. Certainly is, couldn't agree more. Nice to know the Earth is still in one piece in 2032. Music's not bad either.
So while we're on our way to the Transstar building, I wonder what these tests are going to be. They're going to be testing me for, for, for life in orbit, so I'm guessing, you know, it's going to be high pressure, high velocity, high speed, that kind of thing. Oof. With a view like this, why would you want to go to space? Great. Why did they put that on top of their building? Mind the glass on the way out. Good luck to you. Oh, it's gone. Must be an automatic billboard. Hello, Doctor You. Hello. Flying toaster. I'm a Sybil four nine five science class operator. It's looking at me. It won't be long before you're on a shuttle bound for Talos 1. I've only just woke up like 10 minutes ago and you're sending me into space. Welcome, Morgan Yu. They you certainly don't waste time. 9 a.m. Appointment in the testing facility. Please confirm. Well, what time is it now? Okay, going down. Thinking about it, the building wasn't that far from my apartment. Couldn't I have just walked it? Would have seen more of the city. Oh, Morgan, Alex! Finally. Hey, we must be related. We're dressed exactly the same. Ooh, he looks grumpy. Uh, let's just talk to you. Actually, hey. you look grumpy as well. Ooh. You don't look terrible in a transfer uniform. That's very up close and personal. Eye. Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but it's a new family tradition. Breaking convention is in our blood. Once you start okay. the test, just do whatever comes natural. Testing is a Don't family tradition. It. Where Talk are we? Aperture science? You through the process. You're in good hands. We'll be in orbit next week. I promise. This guy is Mr. staring you? at me. They're ready for your brother in room A. Right. Listen. Just be yourself. I'll see you after. Okay. Cool. We'll do lunch. Testing rooms. Ooh. Okay, so I guess we're going straight Good into morning, it. Good morning, Morgan. I'm Dr. Bellamy. Good morning, Doctor. Like we have some tests to run through today. Probably not the kind of thing you're used to, I imagine, but trust me, you're going to do fantastic. Okay. All good? Nice sci-fi system. Let's begin. For this first test, I'd like you to remove the boxes from the red circle as quickly as you can. What red Just boxes? Go with your gut. Okay? Wonderful. Press the red button when you're ready. Ah, nothing like a big red button to get you into testing. Or throw it. Wonderful. That's... You're absolutely fine. Uh, let's move on to room B, then. Am I supposed to not be fine? What's moving boxes got to do with going into space? I mean, it's normal gravity. Test B. My button's not ready yet. Okay, Morgan. Listen carefully. I'd like you to do your best to hide in this room. Take your time. Okay. Relax. Think it over. No, I'm kidding. You only have nine seconds. What? Hit the red button when you're ready to start. Oh, so I have more than nine seconds. Uh, okay, well... There's a chair in here. Okay, I'm crouching. I'm hiding. I can see you. Can you see me? Hmm. Uh, can you see me? Oh. Synaptic register? At all? No? no? That's fine. I don't get it. Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. You mean sorry? You're doing marvelous. Seriously, I, I don't get it. Maybe I'm just really bad at testing. Talk to me. All right. Here we go. For this test, please press the blue button across the room as quickly as you can. Okay. In the most natural, intuitive way possible. Without thinking. Just, just go for it. 
you don't want to button press a button without ready. thinking? I mean, you kind of have to, I mean, you don't just go around pressing buttons. But okay, let's do it. Press the, press it. I'm sorry, can someone please explain to me what's happening? Simon? I'm, I'm wondering the same exactly thing. what Tina brought down. Did you double check? Speaker's still on. Dude, what is your I trip? Oh, Morgan, we're who I can leave. With the equipment. Yeah, so Not am I. Fault. You're doing fabulous, actually. One last room. Let's step into D. Wouldn't let me press the button. Helps if you open the door. Thank you. Ooh. Okay, just a simple step. Well. Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Can I get some coffee? Okay, Morgan. Have a seat at the table for me, please. It's a very dramatic way to Wonderful sit down. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. Ooh, I'm TV. I'm show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Uh-oh. Press start on the screen when you're ready. I'm not one for multiple choice. You're planning a vacation. Go somewhere familiar you know you love, or try something new. Ah, okay, it's just uh, two answers. What do you mean? Ah. Uh. Good. Looks like you've got the hang of it. Keep going. Okay, so far so good. You've been sentenced to death for your actions. How does this make you feel? Well... Well, what have I done? Calm, it was worth it. Angry, no one has that right. Be afraid, I don't know what will happen. Well... It, it depends, what did he do? What actions? Ooh, that's heavy stuff. A runaway train is bearing down on five people who are tied to the track. You could cause the train to switch tracks, but there is one person tied to the second track. So you either kill five people, or you kill one person. And again, it depends who that one person is, you know? If, if they're all complete strangers, like you say, five people, but if that one person is, I don't know, your spouse, it's a tough break. Because... You know, one life doesn't equal a hundred lives. Eh, switch the tracks. Good. Next. A runaway train is bearing down on five people. You're standing on the platform next to an enormously fat man. Pushing him into the track would stop the train. <laughs> How do you answer that? <laughs> stop the... Th How was that going to stop the track? How fat is this man? I... I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't do it. Almost done. A runaway train is bearing down... What is the... All these runaway trains? Am I going to face a runaway train at some point? Five people tied to the track. You could stop the train by jumping onto the track. But you would die. Jump on the tracks. Push the fat man. <laughs> do nothing. I don't know who this fat man is, but the Transstar Corporation does not like him. <sighs> that's... that's awful. If it's a split-second decision, the, the survival instinct would kick in. You, you wouldn't jump on the tracks yourself. But again, it depends who these five people are and the events leading up to it. Maybe I'm thinking about this too much, but instinctive decision, do nothing. I want to live. Interesting. Well done. Well done. We're nearly through it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I want you to take a good look at it. What the? In a moment, I'm going to ask you what... Uh, um, that was creepy. It's empty. Don't touch it! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no no! Oh my god, what do you do to him? You sucks the life right out of him. Oh no. Let's see. Oh, there's gas. Where'd that come from? What's happening? Hello? What the flib? I changed my mind. I do not want a cup of Alex. coffee in this place. Simmons, what's going on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? He's alive. Sedated. Clean it up. I'm on my way. Got it. Was Simmons the angry guy staring at me? Because if that's the case, I'm in big trouble. Thank you for watching IG Critic. 
if you enjoyed viewing it as much as we did making it, then please remember to give a thumbs up, share, and subscribe. For more on video games, feel free to check out our other content here on YouTube and over on IGCritic.com.